what's going on guys it's your buddy MLC Stealth and today we're doing a gameplay of Hitman Blood Money and this game is amazing for those who don't know anyways we're just jumping right into the level I'll show you more about the level and explore uh, in a second but uh, the first parts of this level are very time oriented and you have to do things right away or else you're gonna miss uh, opportunities anyways right here I'm just getting a gun from I guess a jacket that I left here earlier I'm not sure it doesn't really explain how I got there or anything I'll pick it up later. Um, and right now I will be going into the bathroom and waiting on one of my friends to get in here. It's actually not a friend. He's a technician, worker, janitor man, and I'm gonna steal his clothing. <laughs> and after I steal his clothing, I'm going to Wired and walk in different parts of the map because uh, to get to different parts of the map, you have to take people's clothing, and then you're allowed to go in certain parts of the map because you really can't just go everywhere dressed as a hitman guy. Like, hey, can I go back there and kill that dude? Because uh, that's not really how it works. But uh, this mission, my goal is to kill two dudes. And I'll show you those two guys in a second after I take his clothes. And I'm going to kill him with my syringe here. Alright, wait, it's not going to... No, I'm not going to kill him. I'm going to sedate him. Don't mind me. Go back to peeing. Oh, he almost got out. That would have been bad if he escaped, huh? Um, but this syringe is a... Just a sedate... Syringe sedate, if that's what it says. Um, cause I really don't need to kill this guy, it's kinda mean to kill people who don't need to die. And I like how I just leave my clothes plopped on the floor, like, for anybody to see it. Um, now I'm gonna take his body and put it inside this laundry chute thing, I don't know, dirty clothes. It's where dirty bodies go. Um, so now we're gonna explore a little bit of the map, so, oh, let's close that lid. <laughs> I'll be mad if it's just open. Anyways, uh, here is the map. Well, hold on. Alright, one of the guys that I want to kill is in this room, uh, right here, and you can't really go in there, you try, and the guards are like, don't do that, and it's alright, sorry, won't do that. Um, so he has security guards watching him, and a bunch of things, and here's the theater, uh, very, it looks like a theater, nothing really special about it. Um, and one of the guys that I want to kill is the guy right there with his hands behind his back on the pole, let me show you him with my binoculars, that guy right there, the guy in the middle of the screen, not the guy with the gun. Uh, the guy right there. So yeah, and the other guy is up there who I want to kill. You can see his little head just poking out. I wonder if I can binocular his face for you guys. Ooh, nope, can't see him. But here's my inventory. I have a sedative syringe, a mine, a detonator, SMG pistol, assassin fiber wire, binoculars, a coin which I can throw and distracts people. That uh, gun that I just got, and that's it. Um. Anyways, that's the theater this is a theater um, but this game's amazing there's so many ways you can play it right now I'm going the uh, sneaky routes <laughs> like the super uber cool assassin routes uh, what I could do is just have my pistol right now and shoot that guy shoot that guy and then just walk out of the theater like alright I'm done with my assassin uh, obviously that would be like some sort of running and gunning because these cops would probably not and I can't walk back here either because that cops can be like no you can't do that and they'll start shooting me if I try to walk back there um, only actors are allowed on stage. I could even take one of the actors' clothing and go on stage and kill him that way. But uh, I'm going to go the super sneaky route where nobody knows who I am or what I did or any of that stuff. Because it's more fun that way. Um, but I, I love the variety in this game. And normally I wouldn't be allowed to go back here. But since I'm wearing these clothing, these clothing, since I'm wearing this little janitor outfit technician deal thing, I'm allowed to go back here. Because um, normally these guys would be like, hey, you're not one of us, and they would go tell police people, and the policemen would come stop me and shoot me and kill me and things like that. Um, but I, already, I I know this map inside and out. Not actually that. No, I don't. I know this map pretty good, though. Um, so I know what I'm doing. And here's backstage. Like, this cop's guarding it, so if I try to go back there, he'll be like, again, you can't do that. And so, all right, sorry. And that's actually where the actors are on stage right there. And here's the uh, dressing rooms, which I'll be in here in a second. Right now, what I want to do is go up here. And, I don't know, this game's amazing. I just love the different ways you can do things. It's, it's one of those games where you, and here's actually the stage. And just hop down and kill myself and die. Or I could just shoot him from right here. Like I said, variety. You can do this game so many ways. Um, Are you asleep, bro? I hope you don't mind. I'm just going to play some mine right here. Oh, you will mine. Hold on. Let me just... Let me just, uh... Yeah, walk away. Thank you. And place bomb. Hope he doesn't mind. <laughs> um... 
And let me, I'm just going to go down here real quick. Um, but this is one of those games where you play one level for hours until you get it down to like a rhythm and then you know exactly what to do and it's just so fun. Here's a little place where you can, and they're bowing right now. I can just shoot them, shoot that guy up there and walk away and like I said, variety. Um, but I placed a bomb right there and let me show you what I did. I placed a bomb at the thing and you can see that there's a chandelier right there. And that chandelier is supposed to land on somebody. Uh, it probably won't. Ah, son of a, I can't even can't even walk maybe I'm not allowed back here because they're like it says at the bottom left that yellow thing it's on alert or whatever so I feel like I'm not allowed back here oh there we go it's back to green um what was I doing anyways I forgot, I forgot what I was saying uh yeah the chandelier it's supposed to land on somebody and kill that person what I'm going to do I'm going to and right here we can bring up the map Oh crap, I already missed my cue. Ah, uh, never mind, I still have time. Uh, they went into their dressing rooms early. <laughs> Earlier than I thought. I was supposed to already be waiting in that guy's dressing room. Uh, I think I still have time. Anyways, what's going to happen is, in a second, uh, this guy's going to walk out of his dressing room. And I'll just show you when it happens in a few seconds. But uh, this dressing room right here is the guy with the gun. This dressing room is the guy I want to kill. And I'm going to go into this guy's dressing room in one second. One, see, he's going to go to the bathroom in a second. That's my time to go in. Normally, it's my time to... Like, I'm already supposed to be in there, like, waiting in the closet. But things have happened quicker than I thought. I took too long of a detour. <laughs> um, so that's a error on my part. And that guy's normally asleep. I think he's asleep right now. Hey, buddy. Just don't mind me. Just going to walk right in. Didn't even notice. And I'm going to put down the reel pistol and I'm going to take the fake pistol there we go and I think I can just walk out right now yep yeah let's put that pistol away Whoop. and we're safe we're in the clear um, so that's that's what I'm doing I'm switching his fake pistol with a real pistol he's gonna accidentally kill uh, the guy I want dead which is good hey buddy what's up and then this guy the second guy I want to kill is going to come down on stage and be like, Oh no, my friend died. And he's going to run under the chandelier. And right when he does, I'm going to drop the chandelier on top of him. And then I'm going to walk down to the building. <laughs> and that's going to be that. Uh, so pretty awesome. I This game is amazing. It's When you get a clean kill like this, it's fun to do. And I really recommend trying to find these kills yourself as opposed to like going to Google and tr trying to find the super secret assassin ways of doing things. It's just less fun like that. And I'm going to get my assassin clothes back now, just because might as well. I don't really need to uh, sneak around anymore. Um, and there's always just, like, civilians walking around. But like I said, I could take a cop's outfit or I could take one of these security guards' outfits and just, like, walk right into that door and just kill them that way. <laughs> just the variety. I think I've said that word at least nine times now. Um, but they're getting back on stage. So we are going to skip to the part where it gets to the end of the... Uh, the end of the play and he shoots his friend because uh, that's going to be another like three or so minutes so we're going to skip to that so you guys don't have to wait so I'll see you in a sec and what's going on guys I guess we're back so the play is about to end the fat lady is about to sing and this guy's about to kill my assassin target which is good good news I replaced his fake gun with my real gun and things are about to go down so this is the bar where he would pretend to die but he's actually really dying I like how there's no muzzle flash or gunshot or noise or anything, um, but he's, he's dead, uh, so now people are going to start freaking out, so I'm going to sprint away because it looks like I did something when I sprint away, oh uh, no, I just like moving around quickly, and this is the part, I wonder if I can just sneak into this room, I'm going to try, because being right here would be very good, having this tactical advantage, and right here, does someone see me right now? This guy is about to freak out because he's like, oh crap. There's a guy behind me. <laughs> oh yeah, he's freaking out. He's like, Whoa, wait a second. Someone's dead. And they should not be dead. And I hope no one sees me right now. If they did, that would be ridiculous. <laughs> uh, let's get my detonator out. Huh. <laughs> 
Oh, whoops. Ah, success. He, he just tripped right in front of that. Hey, buddy. Don't mind me. And I think that is going to be a successful assassin. Nation. Two assassinations. Um, I hope they don't suspect anything. Oh, they're talking on the radios. That's a bad thing. Don't mind me. I'm just an assassin walking out of a building after two clean kills. And time to escape. Yeah, success, I think. And now just random cutscene. We don't care about random cutscenes. Let's let's look at the newspaper the next day. Apparently there was one witnesses. Don't know how. It was probably that guy who I snuck into his room. Uh, anyways, continue. Continue. I don't know how there was a witness. Maybe it was. It's probably that guy. Um, and then you get to read a nice little cool n news story about this whole thing. And it's pretty awesome. Anyways, that's gonna be the end of this video, guys. If you liked it, please tell me so in the comment section below. And give the video a like rating if you want. Anyways, I'll see you guys later. You have a good day.